today I'm going to be installing a ladder rack onto my Pace Edwards Ultra Groove tonneau cover on the bed of my 2014 F-150 crew cab. So I'll pull this back so you guys can see it. That's the bed cover and I need a way to carry ladders. So I've got this EL series ladder rack which can be removed and installed. And with quite a bit of hardware, some brackets, some pads, and then it's super well packed. And by the way, these are the rails. And uh, they do just a great job of packing this. And so I'm going to get these out. By the way, Pace Edwards is the same company that makes Lear bed covers. They do this in Centralia, Washington, and the Western United States. And it's just great to find an American-made product that is uh, well-made and made in the United States. Because Lord knows we don't make much here in the United States anymore. So if nothing else, this is a great reason to support these guys, is that it is a, an American-made product. All right, so the first thing we need to do is apply set the right way. We've got adhesive strips for these isolator strips that go on the bottom of these. And so we just need to peel and stick. So there are clamp locks that look like this and you put a nut in here and then you have to thread the bolt in. So the easiest way to do that is just hold it like this with your finger and that pretty much positions it in the right place. And then you just gotta be coordinated enough to screw it in. And turn it around and slide this nut into there. And my hands shake a little bit, so it just is what it is. It does not make this easier. And it doesn't help that there's some swarf in here. Let me see if I can get rid of it. There it goes. That's drilling a little bit too fast. I have to say this is my least favorite thing from this company so far. All right, there we go. So I got it assembled. Had to do four of those, they suck. Right. So you need to take these off. And there isn't really an easy way to do this, so. All right, so that's that. So first things first, go ahead and remove this. And then go ahead and unscrew this. One of the failings is they don't tell you if you're putting a ladder rack on that you need to do this differently. And then you can just push this or use a small screwdriver to get it loose.
because you've got to extract this and convert it to a bolt, which is what it should have been in the first place. So then you just reassemble this. And then this needs to be flipped around, and I'll show you why in a minute. You need to configure this for the short edge. These are kickstands, and they help level the rails on the bed. And go ahead and pull it most of the way in, because that's where it needs to be. Okay? So now, you need to sort of imagine how this is going to go in here. And then go ahead and put this together because it's a lot easier to do this out here than it is on the side of the bed working upside down where you have bad access. So the wing nut should face towards the front of the truck on the rear on this kickstand assembly. And it's going to go in here like this. This will slide onto this bracket here and there's little grooves in this that, that tell it basically where to go. there this comes up big high here and you want to move this to where this can go it goes against here all right but you don't tighten it yet so now what you want to do is you want to get that where it's approximately there and you want to be sure not to get this too close to here or it won't be able to turn this is a 7 16 head on this bolt so um, I'm going to do this the way that my hands will thank me. Your mileage may vary. Alright, so that's just kind of snug. And next what we want to do is we want to lock the bracket in. And now we want to go ahead and snug this. They say five pounds, I say snug. All right, that's good. Now we're going to come back here to this. And we're going to use this to level the bed. Just a little bit of pressure is all we need. And then at that point, that's done. All right, so. Next, we need to pre-assemble the tower assemblies. just get these started so that just means putting yeah we're just gonna do that we're just gonna put the washer and the nut on there and just kind of get it get it started but don't really do much with it to do that to all four. So I'll position this so you can see. So I'm going to do that to all four and I'll be back in a minute. All right, so 
The instructions say to do this a little differently. They want you to put the whole assembly together and then put it on the truck. And I'm working by myself, so that ain't happening. And this isn't staying on here. I'm just putting it together, so. And it's getting hot. momentarily. Yeah, those aren't 716s. So let me and I'm not gonna do both because again this is just temporary. But I am gonna do one. Measure my stick out. Eight and a half, six and a half, so it needs to come over to seven and a half. All right, and now I'm going to just tighten things down. stick out at this point. A little too much. using a little piece of tape to kind of mark where this needs to be. Double check. Oh, it keeps shifting.
adjusted right on both sides, so I'm going to go ahead and tighten it down. So we're looking good. Let me show you guys what this looks like. So that's kind of it right there. Check our stick out. Seven, eight, so it needs to come over half an inch. All right, so I wanted to show you guys what the finished product looks like. This is an Ultra Groove tonneau cover with a elevated ladder rack from Lear slash Pace Edwards. And you see it's a real nice fit and finish. It's real clean. And uh, the best part is the ladder rack will slide right off when I unbolt it. And uh, that makes it easy for me when I'm not working storms. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, have a great day.